drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel in the next three seconds and the next time you see your crush she will tell you that she has feelings for you as well hi guys welcome back to the channel as always hopefully all of you guys are having a wonderful day today now today i will be showing you guys an insane working gta 5 online money glitch that most of you guys watching this video will be able to do and get yourself extremely rich now let me tell you one thing about this glitch this glitch is one of the glitches that all of you guys keep asking for as you only have to do this once and after that you can completely forget about it and you'll keep making money now i know you guys are excited but before we get into it if you guys don't know the mod account giveaway is still running and will be coming to an end this saturday one account will be given to one of you lucky winners that will consist of 300 million dollars and everything on the game now you guys will be like wait sky only one mod account while well, your boy can't afford more than one a week because one mod account is like 350 dollars if you guys do want to enter this giveaway all you need to do is follow all the simple steps on the screen first of all subscribe to the channel secondly drop a like on this video and third comment something positive so what i mean by that is you could be like yo you have some great haircut there mate or you could be like you have a great profile pic it doesn't have to be positive towards me just make someone happy in the comment section and you will be entered you can also say hope everyone has an amazing christmas with their family the winner will be announced on saturday good luck to everyone that enters what's out of the way let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into it hope you guys enjoy So to begin with today's video, first of all, small ad break, if you guys are looking for cheap, reliable and extreme fast cash on GTA 5 online, I highly recommend you guys go ahead and check out GTA 5 boosting. For like $35, you can get yourself $20 million on GTA 5 online. If you don't check them out, the link will be in the description. Now this glitch that I have for you guys today is just insane. First of all, the glitch is new. Secondly, it is 100% solo. And third, you only have to do this glitch once and after that, you do not have to repeat it and you will be making money as long as you possibly want on GTA tier 5 online i know it sounds exciting but trust me the glitch is worth it now before we get into it i just want to say while you guys are watching this video actually pay attention to the gameplay because there is going to be a playstation and an xbox code that will just pop up on the screen at any random time as soon as you see it try to type it in quickly because there might be like another thousand people trying to type it in with you if you get it use the money for whatever you want this is like a small christmas type of giveaway i'm trying to do if you guys appreciate it because i am spending a lot of money on these giveaways if you could drop a like on it i would appreciate it as well now this glitch that how for you guys today i just want to remind some of you guys what this money glitch is don't worry if you have no idea what this glitch is i will explain it this is the bunker supplies glitch i know a lot of you guys are already excited wait sky there's a new workaround to the bunker supplies glitch yes you heard it right but before we get into the glitch i just want to say this glitch is a little inconsistent so what i mean by that is sometimes the glitch will work sometimes it won't work but trust me it is going to be worth it because once you guys hit the glitch once after that you guys will not have to repeat it ever again again so even if it takes you three tries i recommend you try again and again because once you hit the glitch after that you will never ever have to repeat this glitch again for the people who have no idea about what this glitch is let me explain it to you so you guys know how a bunker works you simply buy supplies your stuff works on the supplies forms the products you sell the products and make the money what this money glitch is going to allow you guys to do is get your supplies bar stuck meaning you guys will never ever have to purchase supplies again and secondly never ever have to worry about about it you don't have to leave your friends to go check on the supplies if they have run out or pay two hundred thousand dollars every single time they run out you don't have to do any of that once you guys have done this glitch once after that your supplies bar will be stuck and the products will keep forming and you guys will be able to sell it and make yourself millions of dollars now you guys are excited for this glitch one thing i want to say is you guys will need one thing to perform this glitch and that one thing is a bunker that's it you guys do not need anything else to actually perform this glitch now something important i want to tell you guys is this this glitch is not very consistent it's easy but not consistent even if you do all the steps right sometimes it won't work it's not your fault it's just the game didn't register all the steps properly and didn't get the glitch to work so it might take you two or three tries but once you have done it once after that you do not have to repeat the glitch even once now once you guys have a bunker what you need to do is you need to make your way into a public session this glitch is only going to work in a public session once you're in a public session simply make your way inside of your bunker and go to the laptop that allows you to manage everything in your bunker so as you guys can see in the gameplay i'm in a public session i'm at my bunker at this point i simply have to go inside 
and sit down on the laptop. Also, before you enter the bunker, if you're an MC president or a CEO, make sure you leave that before entering the bunker. Now, once you're in the bunker, simply make your way to the laptop. Also, in the time you're traveling to the laptop, I just want to tell you guys something very important, which is if you guys already have some products formed inside of your bunker, make sure you guys go ahead and sell them before starting off with the glitch, because at the start, you're going to lose all the products. And if you guys care about the products, I recommend selling them before starting off with the glitch. Now, once you guys arrive, onto the laptop what you guys need to do is open up your interaction menu and become an MC president so it actually lets you sit down on the chair once you sit down on the chair simply access the laptop once you're on the menu simply log in and shut the business down as you guys can see this glitch is really really easy to do but one thing about this glitch is this glitch is really inconsistent what I mean by that is you guys might follow all the steps in the video properly but at the end of the glitch you will come to find out that the glitch didn't work and maybe sometimes you guys might mess up one or two steps but the glitch which will work. Don't worry if it doesn't work for you the first time, try it again because it's going to be worth it. You simply have to do it once and after that your supplies bar will be completely stuck and you guys will not have to repeat this glitch. Now once you guys shut your business down, all you simply have to do is get off the chair and make your way out of the bunker. You guys saw at the start of the glitch my supplies was a tiny bit lower than full. Just remember that you guys will notice it will glitch out so many times while I'm doing the whole glitch. Now once you guys arrive outside of the bunker, all you simply have to do is open up your interaction menu go to the MC president menu and disband your MC. Once you disband your MC, there will be a huge notification that will pop up on the screen. Simply wait for that to go away, then make your way inside of the bunker and go sit down on the computer. Now, before you guys sit down on the computer, what you need to do is you need to open up your interaction menu, make your way to MC president menu and register as an MC president. Once you register as an MC president, simply go sit down on the chair. Once you're on the chair, you simply need to access the laptop, log in. And once you log in, you need to restart the business and as you guys can see, my supplies bar is tiny bit lower than full. You guys will notice that it will glitch out. Now, once you guys restart the business, simply make your way to manage staff and assign your staff to manufacturing. And when you assign your staff to manufacturing, there will be a black screen and boom. As you guys can see, my supplies bar is completely full. At this point, just simply make your way to resupply and then hover over buy supplies and wait here for about 30 seconds. And you guys will notice that the supplies bar will go down again. Once it goes down, you simply need to go ahead and click on buy supplies and hover over confirm. Now at this point, if your supplies bar did not go full, that's completely fine. You can still carry on with the glitch. You simply just need to click on buy supplies. Once you click on it, just hover over confirm. Now once you're hovering over confirm, what you guys need to do is you need to confirm it. And as soon as you confirm it, you need to disconnect your internet. If you're on PlayStation, I recommend just pressing a PSN button, go to settings, go to network and hover over connect to internet. Then double tap your PlayStation button and come back into the game. Once you're back in the game, you simply need to confirm it. And as soon as you confirming you to double tap your playstation button and disconnect your internet once you disconnect it wait here for about 10 seconds then connect it back then make your way to the playstation dashboard or the xbox dashboard do not go back into the game for another 30 seconds now once you have waited here for about 30 seconds and you guys notice that your friends list and everything has loaded back up all you simply have to do is go back into gta now when you go back into gta you guys will receive this alert that says you've been signed out of playstation or you've been signed out of xbox once you guys receive this alert do not accept it rather press your PSN button or your Xbox button and go ahead and join someone that is playing GTA 5 when you join them the alert will just go away by itself so you'll be taken back into the game and the alert will go away by itself and you guys will receive this alert what you simply have to do is accept it when you accept it after 20 seconds you guys will receive another alert that will say that your game save has failed once you guys receive the second alert that says your game save has failed simply join the same person again and you guys will notice that nothing will happen that's perfect Perfect. When nothing happens, you simply need to accept the seller and you guys will load into story mode. Now, as soon as you load into story mode, you need to quickly bring up your pause menu, go to online, click on play online and load into a brand new public session. Now, when you guys load into the public session, I highly recommend having your spawn location as last location so you guys don't have to keep driving to the bunker. It will save you guys a lot of time. Now, once you load next to your bunker, simply make your way inside of the bunker. Once you arrive inside, make your way to the laptop that allows you to access everything 
everything about the bunker. Once you arrive there, simply open up your interaction menu, become an MC president. Once you're an MC president, simply sit down in the chair, access the laptop, log in. And once you guys log in, you guys will notice that the business would have been started. And at this point, if you actually go to manage staff, you will notice that it would be set to both. Even though you set it as manufacturing, it would just change by itself because it's glitched out. Now, once it's set to both, all you simply have to do is go ahead and shut the business down. Once you shut it down, go to manage staff again and set it to manufacturing. Once you set it to manufacturing, you simply need to confirm it and you guys will be on a black screen. Once you're on the black screen, at this point, you simply need to go ahead and restart the business, then make your way to resupply and buy the resupply. At this point, you don't actually have to speed up or anything. Just simply buy the resupplies, then get off the laptop, then quickly make your way out of the bunker. Once you guys arrive outside, all you simply have to do is open up your interaction menu, disband your MC. That's the first thing. As soon as you disband your MC, you guys need to hold down the D-pad, select one of the story mode characters, and accept the alert that pops up. Trust me, no timing involved. You simply just have to do these steps as fast as you possibly can. Now, once you guys load into story mode, all you need to do is you need to bring up your pause menu, go to online, click on play online, and click on go. When you guys click on go, you guys will load into a brand new public session and you will spawn right next to your bunker if you actually set your spawn location as last location now once you guys spawn right next to your bunker all you simply have to do is just open up your interaction when you put yourself in passive mode and wait here for about five to six minutes so simply just put your controller down go eat some food when you come back in five to six minutes you guys will notice that on the bottom left you guys would have received an alert from agent 14 that would have said your supplies for the bunker have been delivered now one thing you guys need to know is if you guys remember when i actually bought the bunker supplies my supplies were already full that was the part of the glitch now as you guys can see I just received the alert that says your supplies have been delivered for the bunker. Once you guys receive this alert, all you simply have to do is disable passive mode. Then wait for the timer to run out, then open up your interaction menu, become an MC president while you're still outside of the bunker. Do not go inside without becoming an MC president. Once you're an MC president, simply make your way inside of the bunker, go up to the laptop, sit down on the chair, and once you're on the chair, you simply need to access the laptop. Then the first thing you guys need to do is shut the business down. Once you shut it down, you need to go to manage staff and make sure you align it to both, then confirm it. Once you align it to both, you simply need to go ahead and restart the business business once you restart the business you guys need to go ahead and make your way to manage stuff again and then this time just align it to whatever you guys want so if you guys want to form stock without losing any supplies, then just align it to manufacturing. If you guys want to do the research, then just align it to research. And once you guys have set it to one, that's it. The glitch is completed. At this point, you guys will notice that the supplies bar would have been glitched out again. Now this time, once it's full, that's it. It's frozen. It will not go down and the stock will keep forming. Now if it does go down for you the first time, I just recommend try the glitch again because I promise you the glitch is going to be worth it because once you hit it, that's it. You guys do not have to work about supplies ever again was out of the way thank you so much for watching this video today hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like on if you're new to the channel i highly recommend you guys subscribe and see your notification for daily real working gtfi money glitching videos the reason i use the term real is because there are so many fake gtfi money glitching channels out there just try this glitch out for yourself if it works then only subscribe to the channel does that sound like a fair deal i think so now one thing i want to say is thank you so much for the amazing support you guys have been giving to the channel. We're already 10,000 subscribers ahead of 600,000. Our next goal is to hit that big 700k. But other than that, thank you so much for watching the video till the end. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to drop a like on it. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe and become part of the team. But other than that, have a great day ahead and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.